Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Irvin, with another Anime First Impressions. This is going to be on Hensuki. Uh, this one's airing currently, as of right now, I've only seen it on Funimation. Uh, could be that it will eventually be added on Crunchyroll or maybe Hulu, but as of right now, just uh, Funimation has it. Uh, this is one that I think is going to be popular to some people. Maybe not me, but to a greater person or group of people. Uh, before I continue, though, I do want to say a few things. One of you have not done so, please subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell button if you guys don't mind. And you'll be, you be notified when I go live or when I upload videos just like this one. I do have quite a bit of first impression videos out, so go check those out as of right now. And then, uh, secondly, guys, if you guys want to buy some cheap manga and anime, I've seen a few sales already go on. Uh, make sure you check out the link down there below and uh, make sure you use my link every single time you buy stuff from them. That way you guys help my channel grow. Uh, lastly, there is a spoiler alert. Uh, there is a big surprise at the end of this episode. So uh, just, just letting you guys know there's a spoiler alert. Don't let uh, me spoil anything if you guys don't want to watch past this point. Okay, so Hinsuki, or the full title, Hinsuki, Are You Willing to Fall in Love with a Pervert as Long as She's a Cutie? Very obvious where the genre this one is, just by the name. Uh, you know, genre-wise, etchy, lewd, uh, romance, harem, that's the, the genre, school life. That's basically where it falls in, and you can probably already, if you know me by now, probably know where I'm going to this. Now, I will explain the first episode. Essentially, we meet this guy who is in the Koto, uh, or sorry, Shoto uh, club, and he basically has um, uh, his senpai and other girls help clean the room because it's a big mess. And then at the end of everyone cleaning, he stays behind and notices that someone left him a love letter with a surprise with it. You guys can watch the episode if you, if you want to see what, what, what the surprise is. But anyways, the, the, it's a love letter confessing her love to him and he um, doesn't know who it is because there's no name to it. So he starts kind of thinking of all the girls that were in that room. Uh, one was his sister, so he says, okay, maybe it was. It probably was not her. Uh, then there's the, the senpai who is in the shoulder club with him and she... Uh, you know, he explains every girl, and he talks to every girl throughout of the episode, trying to figure out who it is. So there's three other girls who are the possibility. The senpai from Shoto Club, a cute, nice, uh, serious girl, and uh, another one who is very perky and um, works in the library, I guess. Uh, so, so there's all these three options that he's thinking of. His best friend tells him, okay, well... We have to figure out who it is. You know, you have to give her a name for now. They call her Cinderella throughout the episode. And he's just trying to figure out who his Cinderella is. Um, he eventually figures it out. And by, by figures it out, I mean he thinks is his senpai from the Shuttle Club. So he takes her out on a date. Uh, and then he kind of asks her if she likes him on the date. And she just picks up her bag and leaves and she basically ignores him for a day or two and he then eventually uh, forces a conversation with her and she says that um, she doesn't want to talk to him. He says, well, you can scream all you want if you don't like me. She doesn't scream. Then he says, I know your secret. Your secret is okay with me. And this is why I say figure it out because he's talking about the secret of her leaving the letter for him. And she re reveals another secret for him at the end of the episode, which was not the letter. So obviously we still don't know if it was her or not. And she reveals the whole fact that she has this weird uh, understanding of relationships and she wants to be his pet. And we'll just leave it at that. So that is, in a nutshell, the first episode. Uh, not the best first episode, for me at least. I know people that love this genre are probably going to love this anime. Good for you guys. This is the anime that, if you're looking for etchiness, this is the anime for you. Um, very interesting. It was it, There was a time, maybe two years ago, where it seemed almost every other anime was like this. Now, these are slowly 
becoming less important to the community, uh, which I myself am very happy that this is happening. Um, but yeah, there's still a group of people, and obviously, uh, you guys are entitled to whatever you uh, may like. Obviously, I like some things and dislike other things. This is one of those, where is the plot is mainly focused on being etchy. Not for me, maybe for you guys. So, check it out if you guys want to check it out. Out of 10, I'm going to give this one a 5 out of 10. Um, you know, it is etchy. It is eh. eh but I know it is a probably a good synopsis for p the people that enjoy this type of anime. So I'm going to give it a 5 out of 10. I probably won't watch this one at all to the end. But, uh, uh, you know, you guys can. So let me know in the comment section below if you will be watching this one or not. Again, you're entitled to your opinion and to your own likes and dislikes. Like I am also entitled to my likes and dislikes. So thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you have not done so, subscribe. Especially if you're watching up to this point might as well subscribe. Thank you guys so much for the support and love. Uh, again, you guys can be part of the giveaway. There is just a few days left for you guys to be part of the giveaway. There will be multiple winners as of right now because there is already quite a bit of people that have joined the giveaway. But if you haven't joined, go to my channel. If they're on the uh, trailer, you'll be able to follow all the instructions. One, being subscribed. So make sure you do that by now. Uh, and you guys can follow the rest of the instructions and be part of this awesome giveaway. Thank you guys so much for your love and support, and like always, don't be strangers. See you guys.